Hi, I'm Themis Prodromakis and I'm a professor in nanotechnologies in the Zeppler Institute. I'm the director of the Center for Electronics Frontiers and my research focuses on developing novel AI hardware solutions for modern societies. It's particularly important to make those solutions available and now, not just in the UK but internationally, because we want really to democratize the use of AI. I'm delighted to be appointed as a chair in Emerging Technologies from the Royal Academy of Engineering. This really gives me the flexibility over the next 10 years to focus on my research and developing novel AI hardware solutions that consume minuscule power and would really allow us to democratize the use of AI. My vision for the next 10 years is that we will develop these advanced microchips that can be embedded with all sorts of kind of sensors, uh, and allowing us to compress the data locally and not sending and abusing the bandwidth that we have available to ourselves. Processing the data locally also means that we're able to do advanced classification of the data locally, whether it's images, whether it's sound that is needed for natural language processing, which also empowers uh, empowers the users to maintain the privacy of the data if they don't have to use and share the data with the cloud. One of the other solutions that we're developing is advanced memory that would allow us addressing the needs of emerging systems that are continuously on and therefore require loads of storage to save the big data that are captured. The final frontier for my chair is to really enable a new approach for symbolic processing. Doing symbolic processing means that we can, it can lead into explainable AI and we're able to interrogate AI systems and understand them better. For example, for figuring out what has gone wrong if an autonomous vehicle has a crash. Whose fault is it? Who do we count accountable for this? As with any research outcome, AI systems can also be used as a tool to do good but also harm. It can be utilized by different people to have access to your data and use your data without your consent. What is needed from public policy is establishing frameworks for how this can actually be used for good. How can we make them more transparent? How we can enable modern societies of moving forward in a sustainable way? And even of how we can develop our own research in a responsible manner. Engaging with public policy is something that is relevant across all career levels, from early career researchers to very senior professors. My advice to colleagues is to engage with public policy makers from early on. This is gonna really help them understand what is needed from the other side and define their plans in a more clear way and allow them to structure their own research and the collaborations.